hello guys welcome to the next video tutorial on C programming for beginners and in this video I'm going to show you how you can use function in C and what is a function so first of all what is a function a function is a piece of code or a block of code which we can use to perform a particular task for example adding two numbers you may uh, wish to add two numbers uh, multiple times in your program and you can define a function for this to add uh, two numbers and you can use your function again and again uh, or you can call your function again and again inside uh, any other function so let's see how we can declare function but first of all I must uh, say that uh, every C program has at least one function and this function is called main right in the starting of this series I have told you that this main is a function okay and every program has at least one function and this function is called main and whenever you execute your program C uh, searches for this main function and execute uh, whatever inside this. So function uh, more or less looks like this itself. It has a return type. It has the name of the function. Uh, this is an inbuilt name in C which is main. But you can define a user defined function and give it any name and then comes these bracket and then curly braces so let's see how or what is uh, the definition or declaration of this function for example so this is how you declare a function this is not the actual de declaration but the, this is some pseudo uh, declaration I will declare a function in a moment so function you can declare first of all you must have the type of function which uh, it returns and then you give the name to your function and then in the bracket you can pass argument or parameters like this of some type and inside your curly braces you write your code okay so I will just comment this for now so that we can uh, see as a reference see it as a reference right now you can define your function above your main function or below your main function but uh, there is a difference in using or declaring uh, your function above and below which I am going to tell you but let's take an example for example we want to add two numbers using a function so how we can do it or let's take a rather more simple example uh, than this also we want to print something using a function okay so for example I have told you that function start with a return type and this time we for example we won't, don't want to return anything then we write void void means we are not returning anything right then comes the name of the function this name you can define anything for example my function name any f uh, name you can give it and then comes your uh, bracket like this and it can take some parameters and it cannot uh, I mean it you it's your wish if you want to give some parameters to uh, this function or not it depends upon your requirement right now we don't want to pass any uh, parameters but we will see how we can use parameters with function in the next videos so just uh, for now we will not pass any parameter to the function right and then comes these two curly braces and now in this function I want to perform some code for example I want to print something print F and we can say we are inside a 
function right and end line okay now for example you want to you know do some more stuff for example adding some uh, two numbers for example you want to add uh, two numbers and show the sum so you can just write print f this should be print f not print f and then you can write sum sum is equal to and then you can write percentage d and then you can add two numbers for example 10 plus 52 this is just an example i'm giving you so so you can just uh, write your code inside a function any code any numbers or of, of line you can write inside a function and then you can call this function in your main and for calling your function you just need to copy the name of the function as it is just copy this name and then inside your main function which is this one you just paste it here okay and then give a semicolon here and what this do is this function name replace is replaced by this code okay so whenever you call a function this code is also called in place of this function so in indirectly we are calling this code in here inside our main function okay and the logical name we have given to this function so that uh, more or less the name of the function should reflect the code which we are writing okay now we will run the code compile and run the code and it says sum is equal to 62 which is this line sum is equal to 62 and then it's right we are inside a function right so what happens here your program starts from here and goes to the second line and then comes here and it sees that there is a declaration of function so it remembers that this is a function uh, which we have declared and whenever uh, our main function calls this uh, function we need to execute these lines and because we are calling this function inside our main it will execute this okay you can use this function multiple times inside your code also like this like this three times and for example i will just change this line so that we can see it more clearly and you can see some 62 we are in the function some 62 we are in the function three times okay so this shows that you can call a function multiple times in your code and that is the uh, basic usage of function so function makes your code uh, really uh, readable and fast to execute and uh, you can perform this function or call this function again and again so this makes your code uh, really short and understandable and concise okay now some people also like to call this function below your the main function here and there is no uh, i mean difference uh, in uh, declaring the function below your main or above the main but if you want to uh, declare your function below your main you uh, just need to prototype your function just copy this here and paste the declaration here right and i will show you if you don't do this what happens if i don't prototype this i will just delete this and compile try to compile my program it still runs but when you prototype the, your function then you are just saying your c program that there is a function called my first uh, function name 
uh, which we are going to define uh, somewhere in our code. So your C program comes here and sees there is a, a function with a name my function name uh, which is defined in our uh, code. So it goes from here to here and see the definition of the function. This is the definition of the function and this is called the prototyping of the function or forward declaration of the function and then it goes here and whenever your main calls your function it knows that this function is defined here okay so it's a good practice whenever you define a function below your main just prototype it like this and what is what uh, i mean by prototyping you just need to copy this from void to the function not the curly braces but from here to here and just paste it here and give a semicolon here after this okay and run it once again it will execute fine so this is how you can use functions in c uh, there are different uh, kind of function for example function which takes parameter or functions which returns some value which I will show you in the next videos. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.